Hello everyone, this is Amit. Welcome to Notepad++ tutorial. Today we are going to learn how you can add it multiple lines at the same time in Notepad++. Now let's take a, an example code here. I have the C code and let's say I just actually copied the existing you know, function and I would like to change some name of it. Let's say I have these particular uh, this is the name and I would like to change it to reverse word for example. Now I can do search and replace but if I try to do replace all it might change all of them but I only want to change these two. So can I do that? Well Notepad++ has a very powerful feature called multi-editing and we will learn how you can do that. But before that let's take another example and let's go to this index dot HTML and let's say I would like to add a list item you know code at the beginning of it and I have a multiple lines here and I would like to rather than just manually editing or doing copy paste I would like to write uh, you know all four these four lines at the same time so the very first trick is when we can use alt key and use the mouse to select multiple lines. So let's see how we can do that. So I'll go back to my HTML code and I'll press Alt key and then with my mouse I'm going to select right at the beginning and just drag it. Now you can see that my cursor is rather than having just in a single line it is extended up to four lines and you can do as long as you want and so now that I have done that I have ability to to modify these four lines at the same time so I'm going to put some space and I'm going to add just a list item tag and as you can see I can change all of them at the same time and I can do the same thing for the closing tag as well so again I'm going to press alt key and then I'm going to select at the end of these four lines and now I have an ability to actually type at all four lines at the same time so this can save you a lot of time and so that is the first method using alt plus the mouse to select your you know number of lines the second method is totally keyboard based you can do the exactly the same thing as we did it in the first step or first method using alt shift key and using arrow keys so let's try that we'll go back to our code here i'm going to actually undo what i just did and now i would like to actually select four lines using keyboard shortcut so i'm going to press alt shift key and then i'll keep them pressed and then I'll just go down and again you can see that the cursor is extended to all four lines and now I can actually add, uh, add my closing tag at the same time and this can work with any any uh, script or any file in notepad++ for example if I want to let's say comment a part of this I can just go right at the beginning I'll again press alt and shift key and scroll down and now I can just oops sorry uh, well this is not the the well let's go here or yeah so I'm going to do alt shift go down and then just the comment these out and so again this is a very useful method uh, to actually select multiple lines and added multiple lines at the same time. Now the final one is even more powerful. Let's take a look at this C code again. I'm going to actually move this to other view so we can see it side by side. Now in the previous two cases we can only add it multiple lines at the same time if it all started at the same time or at, at the same cursor right. I could not do a cursor here and then here and then here and here right it has to be right at the beginning right here but what if my 
uh, the, the multiple lines that I want to add it has a different places. Uh, the, the text that I'm trying to add it is at different places. For example, in this case, let's say I want to change the name of these two, uh, these two names. So can I do that? Well, so there is a feature called multi-editing in Notepad++. Now, in order to use this feature, we need to enable it. Uh, by default, usually Notepad++ does not have this, this feature enabled. So how can we enable multi-editing? So you need to go to settings, go to preferences, and if you go to editing, the second part of it, just right on here top right section, you can see that there is a multi-editing settings. So if I enable that, it actually gives me a little bit of hint also. It says control plus mouse click or selection. So let's enable that. Click close. And now I'm going to press control key and then I'm going to select my sentences. Now as you noticed, I selected three of them and I didn't select the fourth one. But now I have a uh, an option to add it all those three instances at the same time so I can do reverse word and and if you notice I, because I did not select this last one it did not add it let's try again so I'll go back and let's say this time I would like to change just the sentence so I'm going to press control and I'm going to select sentence, another sentence, and I think that's about it. And I'm going to say change this with a word. Oh, because I had the one uh, selection here, that's why it started here. But let's try again. So I'm going to select this, and then I'm going to select these. In fact, as you select multiple words or multiple you know lines you can see that it is highlighted in a grayish color and so that's how you know that you are selecting multiple lines at the same time so now i can change it to word and that's it i was able to actually add it multiple lines at the same time and so this is a very powerful feature let's try again let's try to change this reverse sentence uh, into something else so I'm going to select, I can do this also, I can select the word first, press control, select my second word, wherever it is, and then third. And now I have all three of them selected and I can change to a new name, so a new name. And so that's, that's about it, we learned three different ways in which you can actually add it multiple lines at the same time. We learn how to do it from alt and mouse method. We also learn how you can do it with keyboard shortcut, which is alt, shift, and your arrow keys. And then we also learn how we can enable multi-editing settings and then press control and mouse uh, combo in order to change or, or added multiple words or, or even the whole line at the same time. So I hope you learned something new today. If you like this video, please click on the like button below. And if you like my channel, please subscribe to get more videos like this. Thank you very much.